Well, here we go again, Andy. This time we've got Adam Watson, the home fighter there from Spennymoor, fighting his debut against Casey Blair, a banger from Banga in, in Northern Ireland. <laughs> Such a great, great jest. Um, Blair's had 13 fights, won three, lost 10. He's only been stopped twice. He seems Generally, very dulable. Yeah, he's been fighting against guy. A, a good level opposition. It's a interesting opener. Interestingly enough, he won his first three fights over in Northern Ireland. Yeah. But he hasn't won one since. Had a good amateur career, Watson. Yeah. Um, X Forces, he just left. He was actually in the Red Arrows. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he was an engineer in the Red Arrows, so. He's been living the dream, now he's living a new dream. Aye. Getting punched in the face. <laughs> I think they're called nightmares, aren't they? <laughs> from, what I've, from what I've heard, he's uh, Watson's another one that you want. He likes to get in there and cause some damage. Have a good tear up. You can see by his, the way he's posturing in the... In the, in the he's, a, he's on his front, he's on his front foot. Yeah. Stepping in with these shots, holding his feet. You see, he's, particularly his left foot when he's stepping forward is very pronounced. Yeah. Oh! Took a very, 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 very heavy right hand there. I didn't quite. The photographer was standing right in front of me when that happened there. Taking a while to recover from that. It was a very, very heavy right hand. He's hooked over the top there. Walked straight onto it. He's mulling his way through. It looked like he was just keeping a hold. thinking about taking a knee there, then he thought, no, I think I'm all right here. He needs to just take that time. Yeah, this is, this is where it comes down to your conditioning for recovering, isn't it? Yeah. Just that little bit of, just that little bit of composure. A little bit of composure. Seems to weather the storm, but now he took another one at the right there. Again, if he took that shot in the second round, he's recovered more. It's it's, it's a, but again, it's his, it's his pro debut. Yeah. Oh, he's looking for them big right hands yeah. over the top, isn't he? Well, I said it was an interesting test for his first fight. Yeah. It's certainly proven that at the moment. So this is a kind of debut to find out exactly if you want to be a pro boxer or not. I think he's just getting involved that little bit too yeah. much, but he should be concentrating on just recovering, you know. And but you've seen a lot of tickets. It's your home debut. Yeah. You've got your fans in front of you, and that's the dangers. That's what happens. That's boxing. It's what one shot. You go in there and be fully, fully in control of what's going on. Take them so, heavy shots, and it, it, it does take a while for your head to get to kill them. What's Jeff Saunders Senior going to be saying in the corner there now? Jeff, keep your hands up. Don't take any chances. He knows, he knows this kick can hurt him, you know, and uh, he's, 
he needs to keep himself tight. He needs to just get back, control his boxing, get behind his jab, not take any silly risks, and just get through the next round as well. Pick it up, make sure he wins the, fight, wins he the was, round. He was totally dominant, wasn't he, until yeah, yeah, that yeah. happened? Which we've talked about it a few times. That's where you can get that element of complacency, yeah. and it just takes one punch. It does, I. It was, it was a very, very heavy shot that he took. Very, very, very. A lot of, lot of kids would have went down, and that would have been it, you know. Mm. <laughs> This is where the test of character comes in, you know. Well, because he did manage to stay on his feet, the likelihood is he's probably, he's probably lost that round. He did like, he started the round well, but he's, he's probably lost that one. Yeah. But because he stayed on his feet, it'll be a 10-9. So if he just sticks to his boxing, yeah. as his, he's been impeached to do so there. I think that's just what he wants. He wants. He needs to get his combinations off and then just make sure his hands are up when he yeah. steps off. Just stay in the that's it, that that's, that, that's the thing, he pushes him back there. Don't get too carried away, don't get too excited there. He's, he's picked the points up, he's put them down, yeah. he's, landed them, he's, he's landed them combinations. Get your hands up and give yourself some space, because like, like I say, this kid's just looking for, he's looking for that shot. He knows he hurt Watson in the first round with it. Oh, as, as, as long as Blair's in there, he's gonna be, he's gonna feel he's got a chance yeah. when, when, when you've hurt somebody like that. But he seems his, his head seems to his head seems to have recovered. He's had some good advice from his corner, yeah. obviously. Me and Morris, get that left hand up when you're coming out. Well, obviously in the Saunders gym, the to get some great sparring down yeah. there, so it'll be good tough sparring. So I know it's not the same as a fight, but yeah. That's why he's just leaving that left hand yeah. on his chest there. That's, he's leaving that left hand on his chest, and that's that's where the opportunity for the right hook over the top's coming on. Oh, now he caught him there. He hurt him with yeah. that shot. Blair just acknowledging that it was a, a decent <laughs> shot that he got hit with. It's another cracking fight, this one, Andy. We've had yeah, some great action that, so far. You see, you see, that's a little bit of difference in experience here by Blair. Wait. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Oh. Really dumped him on his floor there. Oh, oh, and his legs are gone. He's all over the place. No, nah, legs are gone. He I can't think Big Steve Hawkins is going to have a good think about this. Oh, no, that's it. No, that's it. It's the right decision. He actually took a knee on the 10 count there. Yeah. He didn't exactly know where he was. He certainly game enough, brave see, enough. His legs were gone there. The, the, there's only so brave he can be. What a heavy right hand that was there by Adam Watson. A brilliant way to erase all the things that happened oh. in the first round as well. I think Cliff got a cracker on that one. I'll be looking at watching the highlight reel on that one, that's for sure. It showed the character, you know. Adam Watson, Hello. welcome to the pros, mate. How are uh, In your words, it was weird. Like I've been at the ring 14 months now, so getting in there, nice. I don't know. You were hoping to make your debut before this, weren't you? I was. I've been mean, having a few setbacks, uh, <laughs> so I've got in there tonight. And, well, done the job. Was a bit of a slow start, but I'm a bit of a slow starter, so get a few four rounders. Up. We won six rounders. Uh, see the second round, I woke up a bit. Coaches told us what they were going to ball again. Did we have a first round? I can't even remember. I thought first uh, round you started well. You were totally in control. You were planting your feet well, uh, and it it was almost I too easy, and he caught you with obviously the right hand. I caused him a good shot. And I walked straight under it, I think, because the first couple of punches, he chucked the thought he hasn't got no power. He is a bit of peach, so yeah. but it's the 10-ounce gloves, I haven't felt them before, have I? So. No, well, now you have. Yeah, I know yeah. I have. So, um, know. But it looked like for a second that even though it was your first fight, there was like an experienced pro, you're thinking, will I take a knee, will I not? You were just thinking about I, it and you thought... No, I was thinking about it now. That's what I thought. Uh, first thing I thought, am I going to have to take a knee? And I thought, shit, I'm in, I'm in the pros now, so I kind of... It was a good shot, like, um, but I think it was a fact that... So now they, they changed my weight, a couple of pounds extra, there, so I said I was going to have to, well, I was going to get fined if I come in over weight, so you come in two pounds heavier, so I've, could be the difference of having two pounds of fluids in there, so. I, All part of the learning, I, learning curve, I, it's early days. I, I mean, I was in Benidorm four weeks ago, so that's my... Alright, it's all coming out in the wash now. Oh, man. So, um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to 
having a little break now because obviously I've been on it from Christmas well, before Christmas. Obviously, I had a couple of setbacks now, haven't I? Uh, so a little... All the work you've put in is coming good. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I mean, I've been training over Fishburn, uh, South Durham gym, I mean, sparring Jeff Saunders, Bradley Saunders. I mean, what better can sparring can you get? You know what not I mean? Much, not much. So, yeah, I think I've got a lot of work on still. Um, but, but plenty of time to do that. Oh, yeah, I am 25, so. Uh, <laughs> I'm see you in the top, eh? Aye, that's it, So, are you going to get any more, any more action in this year? What's the well, plan? Well, I want to box on that uh, St. James's Park show, to be honest. Like, I know it's uh, not Phil's show, like, but it's a show that I want to I want to get on because all my all my camps in there, Jeff's on, Neil Hepner's on, and um, we've got a new lad, Carl Wilson, cruise away, three lads, in the, so there's four of us on the same show, same gym. Well, a bit of a push, you know what I mean? So. Have a word with Mr. Wraith, yeah. I, know, I know he watches our videos, so. Aye. Hi, Steve, I'll uh, get on that show if I can, please. Uh. <laughs> there you go. Make it so. Adam Watson, nice one. fantastic debut, great learning curve. I'm looking forward to seeing you next fight, mate. Take care, top man. Cheers, man. Good man.